Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Just want to thank you for watching. And like always, if you enjoyed the content, please leave a like on the video, comment below if you have any questions, and subscribe to my channel. So what are soft relines? When should you get them? And what's a hard reline? Now I've talked about these things in my previous videos, but I just wanted to put a video out there so if someone was wanting to know that exact topic, they didn't have to watch a whole 10 minute video, they can come here and get the whole scoop. So a soft reline, what is it? It is basically a extra filler in your denture mold that goes against your gums that helps fill in the gaps to make your dentures more snug. Now your dentist has a special material they mix. When you get a soft reline, it's when your dentures are loose. So you need to have something to fill in the gaps. And so they, your dentist will come and take your denture, clean it, dry it, and then they will put this mixture of material in your denture. It's really, really soft and pliable and they will take your denture and stick it in your mouth and you hold your denture in your mouth for five minutes and that material hardens up. It's sort of like a silicone. Uh, I'm not exactly sure what type of material it is, but it's a softer material. And so now that you have that soft reline material in your denture, it makes you have a better fit. Your dentures won't be loose. Some people, when they have a soft reline, will not need to use adhesive anymore. Some still do, uh, just depending on your preference and how the dentures fit. Besides your dentist doing a soft reline, you can do a soft reline at home with one of the products that they sell on the market, denture fit, cushion grip, or reline it. Those are all three products that work pretty well and you can do at home, but you have to be careful because some dentures have a warranty and if you do a soft reline, it could void the warranty. So you wanna check with your dentist to make sure it wouldn't void your warranty or remove it before you go back to the dentist so they wouldn't see that in your denture. When should you get a soft reline? Now, after the immediate extractions of your teeth and you put your immediates in, the first soft reline is usually done at a couple weeks after the teeth are pulled. Mine was done at two weeks. I've heard some people having to wait a month. Uh, your your gums are gonna shrink a lot those first couple weeks. So that's why after two weeks they do that first soft reline. And then every so many weeks after that. So my dentist did the first one in two weeks and then eight weeks after that one until my permanents were ready. And so every eight weeks I would go back, they would take off the old soft reline, put a new one in and you'll be good to go. So depending on how long you have to wait in between soft relines could depend on how much your gums shrink and the uh, fitment changes. If you have to wait a long time, your dentures can get pretty loose. By the time the eight weeks comes around for me, my dentures are getting pretty loose and I need that soft reline. So that's one thing that you can deal with and that's something like cushion grip it is a good, soft, easy, uh, material to fill in those gaps to get you by until that next soft reline from your dentist. What's a hard reline? So uh, when you're ready and you're done healing, your dentist will have you get new dentures or a hard reline on your current dentures. Now, depending on what you do, if they do a complete new set, you'll just get a whole new set to do wax try-ons and those type of things and you'll get a new complete denture. My dentist did a hard reline. So basically, once I was done healing, they took my denture, they made a new mold of my gums, uh, the current healed bite. So they basically take off the old acrylic and put the new mold on your existing teeth on your dentures. So your dentures that you had with the soft relines and they're really loose and bulky, they'll not be more snug, they won't be as bulky and they'll fit and feel a lot better. Now, when should you get a hard reline? Now, I've heard some dentists wanting to do it at six months. I heard nine months. I would recommend waiting close to a year. So I got my hard reline done at about nine, almost 10 months, and they fit great, but I still had a little more shrinking. So now being a year and a half into having dentures and in my hard reline, I have to do soft relines at home because my dentures are a little loose. So that's why I would wait longer if possible. If you're nine, 10 months, and your dentist wants to do the hard reline or permanence, ask to do one more soft reline, give it a little bit longer to make sure your gums are healed. 
because not having to do a soft rayon on your denture it will save a lot of hassle. So this is a quick and short video I just wanted to throw out there, explain what a hard reline is, what a soft reline is, when you should get them, and just make it easy and simple for you. So I hope this helps in any way. If you have any questions, leave them below. You guys have a great day.